everyone how are you guys welcome back to a daily deal oh my goodness i had so much fun with this daily deal i'm not sure if you guys had a chance to check out the video just prior to this this morning and how my morning was i was just finishing up the um the travel daily deal packs um but no i'm so excited so i have two different daily deals going on today these are things i was going to stock in my shop but i figured i'll go ahead and give you guys a daily deal of ten dollars so anything in the garden or in the travel you get two different choices these packs are 60 piece plus packs filled totally packed i was going to give you an idea what each one will look like obviously this is a hundred percent sorry there goes my cat a hundred percent vintage items so not one is going to be the same but when I show them to you, I'll show you how many postcards or how many um, uh, post stamp envelopes you'll be getting in each pack kind of thing. I did an assembly line. It was quite fun. It was just amazing how much stuff that we actually accumulate <laughs> and we store away and we forget. So it was so much fun just going through my storage um, and grabbing some things out. And what, what do you know? You guys get a great deal. Ten bucks. I don't know how much cheaper you can get on such a pack. Um, I know that, um, my goodness, it's a cat day. Um, I know that, um, uh, uh, that if I did list these in my shop, we're talking about probably going to be like an 18 to $20 pack. Um, but I'm going to do $10 today. If you buy four packs or more, you will be getting free shipping. You cannot beat that at all. So again, there's about 60 plus items. I know I counted this one. This one was 70 pieces. This was 65 Everyone will vary, but you will be guaranteed at least 60 pieces. I just kind of went in assembly line and just went crazy. I mean, it felt so good, <laughs> these stashing, and then you guys get the beauty, the benefits of it. Which one do I like most? Oh, I'm back and forth on this. Um, does it matter? No. Your happiness is my happiness. So I will push the... Um, the travel one aside and we'll start with the garden first i know a lot of you guys love the vintage garden so um if you are interested in a pack down below is the direct link i'll have it in the comment board as well if you don't know how to do the drop down menu please don't forget to thumbs up i love uh offering up daily daily deals often um if you're a crafter um, most likely junk journalers. I know a lot of my following here on YouTube are the junk journal world and I love catering to you guys. If anyone wants to know this year in 2020, my biggest goal, cause I know last year was shop sharing. Um, this year, one of my biggest goals is to provide you guys quality items at an affordable price. I mean, 10 bucks, you cannot beat it. The more you buy, the more you save. I know these weigh 12 ounces, approximately 12 ounces per pack. So if you're my international friends, the weight is not that bad at all. And not only that, you get a lot of stuff. Um, so if you do buy four packs, I mean, you're talking about um, nearly around 300 plus items um, for around $40. Can't beat that, guys. So it's a good time to stock up uh, for your projects kind of thing. And not only that, Easter is coming up. So garden is perfect for Easter. And a lot of you are traveling. So it's perfect to have these packs. Okay. I'll spit it out now. Okay, so each pack uh, for the garden packs, I think I have five, uh, no, I'm wrong. I have seven vintage postcards, and they are all going to be exactly as beautiful as these. They're all the floral, vintage, beautiful floral. It's going to be vintage children. This pack so happens to have these here. Um, of course, you'll have like either birds, but look at these. I'm it just continues on. I know if you're going to grab, you might want to grab now. Ten bucks, you cannot beat it. I can show you the backs. They're all really cool old ones. How about not talking too loud in your ear? I keep forgetting that my camera is put um, back into place and my, my voice is right in that camera. Um, but beautiful, isn't it? Can't go wrong. Every pack is going to have two vintage photos and they're all black and white. Either the retro 50s, um, some of them are the 20s. Um, here's this one here. There's another one in here somewhere. It's just all packed in here, guys. Here's another vintage postcard. You'll get two vintage. That's far as the this one. This one's more like a chipboard. So isn't that cool or what? Here's another postcard, but it's a photo one of a baby. Hope you guys are seeing what I'm seeing. Hope I'm not too too close. Let me see how my frame is. I'm like making it too glary sorry guys it's been a while i have not been on camera as much as i want to you will have calling card at least one calling card um in each pack this is to my mother 
Again, I wonder if I can just push this aside and leave that there so I'm not right in your face. That works for me. So you'll have advertisement cards. This one here is of a child. This one here is armed with purline. Anyways, just really cool pieces like this. Apologize, my nails. I refused to get them done because I was going through so much papers that I did not want to get my nails done and then get ruined again. Look how cute that is. That's the ABCs. I'm not sure. Just different advertisements. Again, everyone's so different. I just grabbed one of the first packs that I had. Look at that cool advertisement card. I know this is just truly packed. There's another postcard. Look at this one. You guys can see this. Okay. How cool is that? Imagine you could do something in the back. Look at how Victorian that is. You will get a pack of stamps, as you can see here. This one here is the different colorful ones you guys see, and I put those in my shop, the colorful selections. Vintage receipts. This is a bank, um, like a bank record, like you can do like a check, but it's like a green color. This one here is ball, like uh, what do you call that, recipe cards. You're going to get a lot of first day stamp envelopes cards. We just see these floral pieces. This came from an old, old book. I forgot which book, but look how adorable that is. So I think it was a French book. Oh, here's a second uh, vintage photo. Look how cool. I would love to be inside that house. 1925, three years old, Martha. Isn't that cute? Flash cards. I don't know how a parrot got in there. I think that was supposed to go on the travel. <laughs> Sorry guys, that's travel. <laughs> hey, if you can see how my office looks like, that's again from that really French uh, magazine. Uh, music paper, every pack will have this with a stamped re uh, like ivy or fern, I should say. Each pack will have two birds, uh, state birds, first state envelope cards. Which This one's New York and New Jersey. More playing cards. Paper. <clears throat> It just continues on. So today's your day. Hope it's beautiful. Some cards. This one here is a handmade card with different little uh, lace and stuff. It's blank on the inside. Another vintage card. Totally, like I said, everything in these packs are 100% vintage. More cards. Look at this uh, note card. Isn't that beautiful? Totally vintage floral. Stationary. Oh, look at this. Meow, meows. I'm telling you what, the kittens, my kittens are gone crazy. This is painted. This is someone had painted this. This one here, someone had drawn on top of a thank you note. I love that. Look at this vintage paper with the embossed roses. This is like a little ideals book, but it's like a devotional. It's called Lift Up Your Voice. Again, this is just giving you guys an idea of what's in each pack kind of thing. Oh, we got that beautiful uh, 1912 uh, different uh, ledger, or I would say time journal like page. It's both on both sides like that. It's more stationary. And then you're going to have two pages from a Rose magazine. I left it intact where it's one full page. What's cool about how big these pages are, um, they're perfect if you fold them in half for your journaling. So you get kind of like uh, pretty much four pages out of that. Each pack is going to get two pieces of vintage wrapping paper. This one so happens to have that rose one. And look at this, that music page. Again, this is beyond 60 pieces. I just went crazy. There's more paper. Here is one of those cards that you can customize this love one another again just beyond this was one of the music books but I thought someone might be able to use that for something you got these here I put two of these in here you've seen these in the past but I had so many left and I thought well why not they're just beautiful like pressed and then this here is in this pack kind of thing all right guys there is the garden again it is packed you can't beat that for ten dollars um look how cute that guy is just so much stuff, beautifully packed, beautifully done, perfect for your, um, your, your craft project. Okay.
this one here, like I said, I know there are 70 pieces, well, 71 now, um, pieces in them. A lot of them have the first day envelopes. Everything is going to be like vintage travel themed, guys. You cannot, I mean, you can't go wrong. I promise you will be happy. I wish I can show every pack to you guys. Um, look at that. Like, a, I can't even think this morning, guys. I need more coffee. This one here, look at this cool bag. I had a few of them like this, but that's uh, cigar clippings. It's like an Indian type bag. Really cool. Look at this. The Cowboy Capital Dodge City. Really cool. I imagine you take a little thing and open that up. How cool. They're like first day envelopes. Some stamps. Look at this. I'm telling you, I should go a little faster. There is so much. It's, it's just beyond. You always have so many beautiful stamped envelopes in, in these as well. There's that cool parrot postcard. You guys, I just so much. Vintage Play Money, Time Saver Stamps, Playing Cards, Retro Advertisement. Look at that. And then, you guys seen this if you're watching my live, where it's got the letter on the inside. So run on over there, guys. I'm telling you, you can't beat it for $10. Here you got another bag. This one's Snappy Popcorn. You got some milked uh, wooden chips, like, you know, like the wooden nickel. And then you got the pure fresh milk tab, which I've seen people do those as um, dangles and stuff. This here is the um, the dairy milk like cover top. It's really cool. Some postcards and then playing cards. You guys, it's just packed. These are going to sell out really fast. I have a feeling I'm going to have to make another 25 of each. Here's another one of those. I have a feeling I'm going to have to make another 25. These are from the 80s. So what's cool about when you get your pack, too, it's going to be a total surprise. Like, it's just, just so much stuff. Um, and it'd be fun to read the letters that are in here kind of thing. Look at this one. I called you. And it's the person's name. And they missed your call. And then there's a post four cent stamp. Play money. Can't go wrong, right? This one here is an uh, like an open envelope. You can open this up, but look at this. It's like a, a little bit thick. I imagine you can 1983. This here, this is really cool. It's got like the clear, which I did the same thing. Every pack is going to have an envelope just like that. I put a bunch of stamps. I don't know if you can see the stamps in there. Uh, a bunch of stamps in there. Time saver like coupon cards. This one here is Post Office Department Official Business. Notice request. We have um, National Bank Receipts. This one here is Business Records. Game Cards. We got receipts here. Look at that ledger receipt. More total scar, uh, total uh, card, scorecard. Um, this is like a bank advertisement. It's like a chipboard feeling, um, but it's cool. And that cool would be a cute little tag. Some more receipts. This is United Airlines. Look at this cool vintage retro picture. See the Coca-Cola in the backdrop? How cool. Look at the bug. Slug bug. The slug area now. I think that's a slug bug. It looks like one. <clears throat> and then driver's daily log. For the freight lane of uh, every pack has those i know that every pack has the play money as well time saver stamps a card that is blank with an envelope we got another postcard how cool another postcard donkey again you guys every pack is going to have a, a pack like this and it, all it has is it has the um the first day stamp envelopes unused they are just um official first day stamps like this one's an airmail this one here. Everyone's different though, guys. Um, so you cannot go wrong. And maybe you can use this this here to store some way, somehow. Look at this one here. It's like embossed airmail. Five cents. Chicago, Illinois to Alaska. How cool is that? This one's nautical. Each pack is going to have um, two pages like this. I got from um, Italy and Greece. So 
sorry, the little glare there, but I left it full pages. It's really cool. Let's look at it. So much you guys can do with these things. Here's the other one, the Coliseum. And then each pack is going to have uh, the stamp page here from the 1940s. Some will have stamps, some will have just, uh, some sides will have stamps, some sides won't. Vintage dictionary pack. I paper clipped this one to keep it all together. But the coolest vintage dictionary. Look how cool. Different sizes for you guys. This one's really cool. And the two pages of that in there. And then this one is the retro one children and then looks like we have three maps three really cool maps these came from an awesome vintage magazine again guys run on over there there's so much to uh share with you guys this would be so cool for your journals so look at this one here all right guys i hope you love my ten dollar deals i can't get any better than that guys i mean my like i said this goal is affordable and quality this year guys so enjoy that ten dollar daily deal grab them while you can if they run out i guess i'll have to try my best to make more um but uh, i have plenty to go around guys so grab them while you can buy four or more like i said you get free shipping us only and um international guys um you guys the, the weight is awesome so you should be just fine um like i said 12 ounces is around the, the the weight but hey if you buy more it's worth the extra expense so all right guys i'm glad you guys watched my daily deal enjoy the garden and the vintage travel you guys have a blessed day get them guys bye